Hey guys, today I'm going to be bringing you another video. I'm going to be bringing you how to make a Gmod server. So, yeah. What you want to do is you want to go to Google and you want to type, you want to search up in Google Steam CMD. Click on this one and it'll bring you to this website. And you want to go all the way down to here. Click on this one. But if it doesn't work and if you get a 404 error, click on this. It should start downloading. And when you get that, you want to go to your folder that you had. And you want to put it in here, and you want to click on it. And what you want to do is, you want to wait for this to load up. And you want to log in. Anonymous. Cannot type today. Okay. It should be connecting anonymously to the Steam public. And it says success. You can type. There you go. You want to force now. You well, before you do this, you make another folder of where you want your Gmod stuff to be. You want to do okay. Then you want to go back here. You want to type in force underscore install underscore dir, and then where your folder is. So it, mine is like let's see like wherever your folder is. Just type that in. So like C and then. So then that uh, here's and then it's that one and then it's my computer name and it's desktop and it's here it's gonna be like Gmod. It should start downloading. I don't know. It should Nothing should happen, should just say that and stuff. And then, um, thing you want to do, you want to do app underscore update 4020, and it should bring everything to that folder. We have one, I already have one doing going because I'm redoing mine and stuff. So it should look like this. It should take a while. Then, after it's like done, you want to do, you want to do, um, app update 4020. Validate, and it should do this whole pro whole do this whole pro process again. It should take a little while too. So when that's done, you want to go to here. Put a link in the description. Do a, actually, you want to go here, and then um, you want to name it whatever you want it to name. Mine's that, and the passwords like that. If you want people to join. Your server with the password, you want to put in a password here for like friends and stuff. So then you want to click Run CFG Maker and copy this. If if you have if you want people to join with the password, you're gonna have three. But uh, copy this. Then you want to go to your folder. Uh, yeah, okay, that one. And then you want to go to your Gary's Mod folder. This should pop up like this and like this. I'll tell you what this is in a little bit. Click on that. Then you want to go to your CFG folder. Click on the server. And you want to paste whatever you had. And then you want to make sure you have this if you want to play like Trouble in Terrace Town on your server. You want to type in Game O Terra Town. Because, um,. Here, I'll show you uh, if I can find it. Uh, game modes. You'll have Terra Town, just the folder and stuff, have everything in it. So you want to type in Terra Town in the auto exec thing. They want to go back here, and you want to make a start dot bat thing. So you want to open it. Oh, that's not what I want. Nope, don't oh, go away. You want to this, and you want to go. You want to go to Google, you want to type in SCRDS and then click on the install thing for Windows. I don't know about Mac, I'll, I don't really know what to do for Mac. Um, you want to copy this and you'll get. Um, you want to change down here, Counter Strike to Gary's Mod. And you want to change the map to. Um, say if you want to play on a sandbox map you want to type in gm underscore construct 
And so yeah, just exit that out. And if you want to play on a gear, on a TDT on your a uh, trouble and terrorist town game on your server after the max players type plus game mode space terror town. And so yeah, that will do it. And port forwarding, you want to go to your port forward. You want to type in your IP address or not. Your TCP will be this 2700-27015 and then this UPD UDP 1200, 2700-27015. I don't know for every router, so don't ask me. And to and you, if you want to find yours, type CMD. You want to type in IP config. You want to find yours so right here, the IP forward address, and you want to type that in your IP address. So you want to click save. Hit somewhere. And yet that will happen. And yeah. So next, you're going to want to do is you want to click on your start. It should run. Mine doesn't apparently right now, but I'm fixing. I'm trying. To, I'm in my, uh, progress on making a new one. So. That should work, and when you go to Gary's Mod, you want to click on the start thing on the, um, your folder thing. It should pop up on their local network. Just join it, and pretty much it. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.